try and... Saw it. The other day, a family with four sons moved in next door. Eldest son, 18 years old. Second son, 17 years old. Third son, 16 years old. Youngest son, 7 years old. There they are again, sitting in front of the convenience store. Stay away. The three older sons were your typical delinquent types. Oh, that's Kuroki-kun, the youngest son. I think he's in the same grade as my son. The youngest son always wandered around outside, even when it was dark. Ugh, I must have scared him. Mom, I saw Kuroki today at the park. Oh, did you play with him? No, I tried talking to him, but he just runs away and hides. His hair is dirty and so are his clothes. We all call him ghosts. Hey, you shouldn't say such things. A few days later... Ah! Are you okay? What's going on? Ah, Karin saw it, I'm sorry. It's just that there was this boy in our yard I've never seen. It startled me. What is a young boy like that doing outside at these hours? Where are his parents? Hmm, I probably should say something. I'll talk with his mother in the next town meeting. So I did, but... Okay then, can you look after him? Excuse me? Neighbors helping neighbors, right? Thanks. I couldn't hold a normal conversation with her. I consulted the police and child services, but they wouldn't help. All I could do was watch him from a distance. Two months later, my son's class was going on a field trip the next day. Coming! Ah, uh, it's the eldest son from next door. What does he want? Um, where can I buy a backpack, picnic blanket, and a lunchbox for kids? What? Uh, um, you can buy backpacks and lunchboxes at the store in front of the station. Picnic sheets you can find them in 100 yen shops or home improvement stores. You can probably get it all for under 5,000 yen. Thanks. The next day. My little brother was able to go on the field trip thanks to you. Here, take this. No problem. Just as I thought he was getting all that for Kuroki-kun. The other older brothers came by the house too. Um, where can I buy calligraphy stuff? Where can I buy clothes for kids? We need to get some rags to bring to school. Where do I get one? Every time I helped them out, they always bought something in return the next day. Here, treats from the older boys next door. Yay! And Kuroki-kun stopped roaming around at night. Ah, uh, hello. Hey. Let's play soccer! It's good that you're looking after your little brother. Um... Are your parents busy with work? Well, um... We have different moms. Oh. The older three, we have the same mom. But Kuroki... He's our father-in-law's son, so our mom completely ignores him, and our father-in-law is useless too, so we decided to look after him. So when he was going on a field trip... What's this? Field trip guidebook? You're going on a field trip tomorrow, right? You have a backpack? A water bottle? Plastic bag picnic chic. Water bottle filled with tap water. Kakapi. Dad's old handbag. You were planning to go with these? So we went out and bought a backpack and a lunchbox. We bought food from a convenience store in the morning, packed it into the lunchbox. Our mom didn't take care of us when we were little. Whenever she had her boyfriend over, we got kicked out of the house. Just like with Kuroki, she didn't help us prepare for field trips either. Watching him like this, we just couldn't take it anymore. We don't want him to go through the same thing, you know? The older brothers stopped being bad boys after that. I often saw the four of them walking together. Hey, back from shopping? Yeah, we got a coat for the little one. Hey, Kuroki-kun looks warm. Yup. I'm so happy for you, Kuroki-kun. What great brothers you have. そんな子供をほったらかしにするなんて許せませんね。お兄さんたちは反面教師にしてくれて良かったです。皆さんはどう感じましたか？コメント欄に書いていただけると嬉しいです。また少しでもいい話だなと思った方、チャンネル登録と